welcome to my class today i am going to take your evs subject in that we are going to see lesson number 5 types of clothes before starting to our lesson they have given us little warm up we are going to see that look at this pictures of clothes write the season in which you wear them take the help of the words given in the box they have given your the box summer winter rainy and they have given the pictures of the clothes we have to write in which season we are using this clothes see first you can see this is raincoat yes raincoat we use in rainy season so we are going to write the spelling of rainy okay then the t-shirt t-shirt we use in summer season so we are going to write here summer then jacket jacket we use in winter right so we are going to write spelling of winter rest of the three you are going to write see gum boots gum boots we use in rainy so you are going to write here rainy season shorts we are going to use we use in summer season so you will write here summer and this sweater we use in winter so you are going to write here winter okay now in this lesson what we are going to see clothes and season and uniforms see students we wear different types of clothes in different seasons right when season change we change our clothes also we need clothes to protect ourselves why we need clothes we need clothes to protect ourselves from heat cold and rain yes so we wear clothes according to the seasons that's why we use uh, clothes according to the season clothes and seasons we wear clothes made of cotton and linen in summer yes in summer season which clothes we use cotton and linen cotton cloth is made from cotton wool of the cotton plant and linen is made from the flax plant what is flax plant a plant with blue flower that is cultivated for its seed and for the thread made from its stalk and linen is one of the oldest fabrics used by humans it is the oldest fabric now cotton and flax are spun into threads they are spun into threads then cloth is woven from these threads first what they make they make threads and from then and then they cloth is woven from these threads by hand on looms looms means a hand op operated or power driven apparatus for weaving or you can say it's a machine containing harness and all okay harness threads cotton and linen clothes make us cool cotton and linen clothes make us cool we wear woolen clothes in winter when we wear woolen clothes in winter like sweater jacket right in very cold places people wear clothes made up of fur wool is made from fleece of sheep and goats silk is made from the silk cocoons of the silk worm what they are saying wool is made from fleece of sheep fleece means the wool coat of a sheep and goats silk is made from silk cocoon now what is cocoon cocoon a covering of thin threads that some insects make to protect themselves before becoming an adults so cocoons of the silk worm people knit woolen clothes by hand see you can see here it is made by hand woolen clothes are also made in factory woolen and silk clothes keep us warm yes in winter season we wear sweater jackets caps made up of wool right and where we get wool see the fleece where we get wool from sheep and goats yes in the rainy season we wear rubber or plastic coats in the rainy season we wear rain coats yes you all know rain coats over our clothes these coats are waterproof why we wear that coats because that are waterproof water does not get through this waterproof clothes known as rain coats they are known as rain coats these clothes keep us dry when there is rainy season we use rain coats so because of rain coats they keep our clothes dry see students did you know clothing varies with geography climate geography climate culture and tradition of the people now uniforms 
school students wear school uniform some adult also wear uniforms at work what they are saying you are students right you all wear a school uniform when you come to school but some adults also wear uniform at work at some places adults adults means big person means those who are big from you yes they also wear a uniform at their workplace soldiers in the army wear uniforms that help them hide in jungles why they wear that uniform because it helps them to hide in the jungle nurses wear uniforms too the nurses also wear uniform yes we have seen the nurses they wear white uniform when patients see someone in this uniform they know they can call them for help when they wear their uniform if any patient needs them yes the patient can call them for help astronauts wear clothes that help them to stay safe in spaceships an astronaut's uniform or outfit is known as space suit you can see here this is a space suit yes this is astronaut's space suit now see what little scientist is saying we should wear light color clothes in summer and dark color clothes in winter little scientist is saying when the summer season is going on we should wear light colored clothes and in summer and in winter we should use dark color clothes in light color it protects our body from heat and in winter when we wear dark color it protects us from cold now we are going to wind up our lesson in this lesson what we have seen types of clothes clothes based on seasons summer winter rainy in summer which uh, which type of clothes we wear cotton and linen in winter which type of clothes we wear wool and silk in rainy which type of clothes we wear rubber and plastic and clothes based on work or uniforms okay students i hope you all have understood this lesson so to now we are going to evaluate first a question is strike out the incorrect word we wear cotton and linen clothes in summer or winter summer so we are going to cross winter waterproof materials keep us dry wet when it rains they keep us dry so wet is the incorrect one so we are going to cross it now draw lines to match correctly now we have to use scale linen and cotton are used in summer so we are going to match with the scale then looms looms are what looms are cloth so we are going to match it then fur fur is a fur is used in winter then rubber and plastic are waterproof then knit is woolen clothes now fill in the blanks we need dash to protect ourselves clothes c l o t h e s then wool is made from the dash of sheep and goats fleece astronauts wear special clothes to stay safe in space now state true or false people who do certain kinds of work wear uniforms yes so it is true linen is made from the jute plant no so it is false we wear the same clothes for different seasons no so it is also false now answer in one or two words where do we get this fibers from linen flax plant cotton we get cotton from cotton plant and silk from silk worms what kind of clothes do we wear to stay warm woolen clothes then answer in sentence this question answer i am going to give you in your notebook okay students i hope you all have understood the lesson so we are going to meet in the next lecture
बाय टेक केयर थैंक यू